Good evening and welcome to Collector Cars. I'm Lance, your host. We've got a little bit of a crazy evening going, folks, so bear with us a little bit. First of all, last week you saw me and Mr. Petty alone. Everybody deserted us. Isn't that right, Mark? Uh, Trier's in we Georgia, Morgan's is in Tampa. Yeah. So you and I just held down the fort while they were gone. Yes, we did. All right, here we go. Tonight we have Mr. Petty, the racing guy, Mr. Trier, the antique guy, oh, well. and Mr. Morgan's the photo guy. Yes, sir. How, How you doing? doing? Good. Good evening, and welcome to... Oh. Oh. I almost couldn't get here. You almost can't get here from my house now. With all the roads they got blocked off and they're working on and everything else, my wife is hollering and I'm getting, you know me, I get frustrated with all that. But I noticed she was driving and she did get you here. Hey, hey, <laughs> finally I had to go all the way down to McIntosh to come all the way out to Fruitfield to come up and do a U-turn anyway. Bill and I could have had the show done by the time you got uh, I know that. I There's know. a thing well, called see, the I was state. concerned about yeah. That's why I was going so fast. I, I figured, know. you know, I figured you guys, one of these days you're going to start without me. We are. I know that. Maybe more than I once. know that. Hey, listen. We got news, news, Mr. Petty. News? What news? Well, your first night of racing. Oh, yeah. In the Petty race car. Yeah. You took, what, fourth in the... Heat. In the heat. Fifth in the... Fifth in the feature. Yeah. Not too shabby for your first time out. We tried. I guess. When you get in that car. Hey, hey, he's a Petty. Yeah. That's right. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. It's in his you see Number 43. Wait you see his Petty race car. It's going to have the, the flames. You know that logo The logo on the front. Lance is cruising the hop with the flames. Well, that'll make him go faster. Yeah, that, that'll do it. <laughs> yeah. That, wait till he gets well, the bill. Well, it will. Yeah. Wait till he gets the bill. Hey, wait till I get behind the wheel and race. Yeah, wait till you, I can't wait to see you behind I the wheel. I got about another, I got, I can think of, I think about another 15, 18 pounds before I can. Well, you can squeeze in. If, if, if the seat's tight on you, it's. Uh, you you got to get them out, though. It, it'll Dave, be cutting my air off. Dave, I might get in. You might have to cut the thing up to get me out. Dave for shot got in the car. He did. Don't tell anybody. Don't no tell his wife. No kidding. But Dave Ooh. got in the car. Well, Didn't Dave you just tell his wife? Car. I don't know. I mean, I, yeah, I, I, I kind of think that that's uh, a good thing there. Great. Oh, there are people that watch the show. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. I got a couple of announcements uh, to do first because I, I, I certainly don't want to, you know, miss, miss some stuff at the end. We had another death. We had Mr. Tony Giglio passed away. Tony had the beautiful blue Camaro. Mm -hmm. Wonderful guy. He's been battling stomach cancer for a long time. Um, he's been on hospice watch kind of on and off for, I think, two or three months now. Mm -hmm. So we kind of knew Tony was, you know, uh, not going to be with us very long. But please keep his family in your prayers. Uh, we appreciate that. And uh, all the uh, cruisers that we've lost recently, Mr. Tom Sullivan with the 71 vet, Mr. Bill Kane, uh, and the others before that. Yeah. So it's been kind of a rough season with that. So uh, that's one of the reasons we all got to try to stay healthy and, you know, keep this all going. Uh, we have something special tonight. Well, uh, I, we'll, do, we'll do your calendar at the end. We'll, oh, absolutely. We'll, we'll do that at the end, we'll show them that. But we have um, a very special uh, cruiser with us that has a gorgeous collection of mostly all their, I think they're all originals, aren't they, Bill? Oh yeah, these yeah. are all original cars. I don't cars. think he's got any of them souped up. Yeah, and you know what? I tell you what, I'm not going to prep you for this film clip. We're going to let Mr. Trier um, discuss this with you, show you the cars, tell you the cars, because you went out there and did some pictures. Wonderful, he did wonderful what? people. Pictures. Oh, he went out and did photos. 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 Photo guy. Photos. Yes. Photo guy. Yes. Oh, man. Your job when yeah. you're in Tampa. Yeah. It's for my calendar that I have. <laughs> 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 All right. Mr. Uh, Perkins, if you're ready, roll it up. This is Dave and Babe Lanning with their car collection. Check this out. Yeah, this, uh, this is a nice, nice T-Bird that they've got. Here's Dave and Babe tending their own car in front of their own gas station in their own yard. Everybody should have something like yes. this. Oh yes, we need this. Mobile station right there in Englewood in his yard. And 
I, I think he sells everybody gas for 50 cents, right? Dave? Dave's yeah. with us tonight. Yeah. Look at the uh, details there. Now, you know who's the boss because you can see the, the order of the names. Right. Yeah, right. Babe. He's babe. a smart man. Wife. Yep. That's right. Well, look at look, look at the at things this. they have inside. I mean, just like you walked into a 30s or 40s gas, gas station, station, you know. Remember when the kids used to play the pinball? And mm -hmm. Now, some of the cars that come in there must be real old. Look at the sizes of the tires back there. <laughs> and look at this nice automobile. Yeah. Kids will go crazy with these models. Oh, yeah. He's got, this is all in one of his garages he's got there. Just, just fantastic displays of things to see. Looks like he's got a lot of uh, books and stuff. Oh, on the everything. Cars. Now, this is a neat car. This is the Hudson, a 37 Terraplane pickup. I saw that last week. Yeah, and that's that's quite a, a rare unit. They were unbelievably custom built at the uh, factory when new by taking new sedans and cutting the body off behind the front doors and adding on the pickup bed. I bet okay. the cost and accounting department went fun with that. Had fun with that. Right. Had to figure out a profit, yeah. you know. But that is interior. Isn't that nice? There's the interior of and, it. And seeing those, I you know the the bed is real long. Yeah. The cab is real short. I, There's uh, the original Flathead 6. These these are all original vehicles, too. These have not been altered there. The real McCoy. Look at that single side mount on the front fender. Kind of a trademark of those vehicles. And there's where they uh, would remove the back end of the body of the sedan and, and then finish off the back of a cab and put, a, put a, a deck on the back. Now, here's this 41 Pontiac, and this is... A uh, all original car, it's a Silver Streak Torpedo Model 29, and that's all original except for the paint with an actual 20,000 miles on it. I mean, it isn't wow. a lot of who, who kept cars like this? I mean, Dave. Well, I know, but I mean, uh, he's smart enough. He, he he outsmarted all of us. Apparently, we should have <laughs> done the same thing. Apparently, and here's the original straight eight engine in that 41 Pontiac. Beautiful, beautiful design. I like nice the chrome on that. Isn't yeah. that pretty? That goes right over the fender skirts and all. That's cool. And that was kind of brought back in the, in the late 40s, almost with uh, Chevy did that. Mm -hmm. Now here's a recent acquisition he just got a few months ago, and this is a 29 Hudson Super 6, an all original Survivor with 42,000 actual miles. Wow. That's original paint, original chrome, original upholstery. What a nice, nice car. That is gorgeous. And not only are these, the cars, and the radiator badge. are these cars cool, but they're not your normal Chevy and your Fords. Right. Right. Now look at the interior. That's original. Oh. Oh. Original Mohair interior. Isn't that just beautiful? That's amazing. Wow. Okay. Very, very mm. distinctive, beautiful style on that. Artillery award wheels on it. What was the year on that again? 29. 29. Now, this is a uh, 35 Hudson Terraplane model GU Deluxe four door sedan. Another beautiful, look at the style. Look at the, almost a lot like the airflow coming mm -hmm. into the Vogue there. Uh, this is an all original Survivor with 30,000 actual miles. That's all original interior in there. <laughs> Unbelievable. Very cool stuff. And uh, he and his wife have owned this car for 44 years as his second owners. Mm. Still on its original warranty. Yeah. <laughs> that's yeah, I hope he doesn't Isn't have to take it great? in for any servicing. <laughs> yeah, that's great styling. Right right at the back window and everything. That is just yeah. fabulous. Yeah. Pretty? Now here's the uh, 52 Hudson Hornet Coupe we see quite a bit, it comes to the shows with. That's a gorgeous, gorgeous car too. Nice color scheme on that. That would show up nice on a calendar. That would show nice up on a calendar. Yeah. Look, look at the gorgeous interior, that's an elegant instrumentation in the, those cars. Just this was a pretty panel. Uh, what is dual There's, range hydromatic well, that's, selector? That's it, right there. That's it, it has the hydromatic transmission, dual range. You see the two ranges there and then of course there's your famous oh. twin h power yeah. six cylinder maybe he'll loan that to you to let you race it one night they Thank were they know. were bump <laughs> you up into third and second place yeah but <laughs> hudson hornets were a very well used yeah. race car they did very well yeah. and look at the back